Hi guys, this is Miss TC. And today I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about how we're gonna do things in art when in-person starts on Monday. So things are gonna be a little different this year. This year, um, I am no longer have an art room. We are gonna be art on a cart. So I am coming to you and I have a new cart. I have named him Crispy because he is crispy clean and I will be coming to you in your classrooms. So we have a schedule posted and we'll be coming around and doing it. We will also continue Zooming and I have sent out an email so the parents will be getting the email on when you can log in for live Zooms twice a, twice a week. Okay, so I wanna take a, one, a moment and talk about how, um, since we've been doing virtual for the past six months, how it's gonna look now that we are going to return to in-person classrooms. Okay, first off, rules. Rules are very, very important, and everybody needs rules in all aspects of their life. Now, there's rules for riding a bike, driving a car. There's rules for um, at home, what time you have to go to bed. If you do your chores before you um, get up from the um, table before you go out to play with your friends. There is rules for how much time you get to game with your friends on the computer or how much time you get on your iPad. So we all have rules. There's even rules here at school. What time you have to be in school, what time you have to meet the bus to get to school, how we behave in the hallway. And there's rules now due to COVID-19, what we have to do. And we have to follow separate rules now that are a little bit more special. So one of those rules is gonna affect the art room. And I used to tell everybody, oh, in art, we all have to share. I want everyone to share everything. I put the supplies out and we share. This year, I'm gonna tell you the opposite. No more sharing. Even though it's really nice to share with our friends, one of the rules because of COVID-19 is that we're not gonna be sharing anything with our friends. We're gonna keep our own supplies, at our desk and stay in our desk. So when we're at our desk, we're gonna maintain our distance of six feet. We're not gonna let get near each other. We're gonna stay in our seat and we're gonna have our own materials to work with. And we're gonna keep our materials nice and clean. And I'll pass out materials and I'm gonna give directions out in front of the room and we're gonna keep our spaces nice and clean and we'll give you time to wash our hands after each class. And at that time, we're gonna wash our hands in warm, soapy water for 20 seconds. And we'll probably maybe sing the happy birthday song for the younger kids. So maybe we'll do that twice. So you get the time limit of how long that would be for 20 seconds, rinse them off, dry them. Um, if we don't have running water in a classroom or if we're outside saying doing something at a picnic table, we'll have some of this so you can wash your hands. We'll put all our materials back in our bags our baggies that I'm gonna provide for you, all your, your materials, and then they'll go back in a box that'll be just yours for that, for you, you to only use. Nobody else can use them, okay? Now, we wanna make sure we follow these rules because we don't want any germs to get on anybody. So we're also going to wear a mask. So I have my mask right here. So when I'm teaching, I'll have my mask on. And I'm gonna have it real nice and tight around my ears against my nose. I'll make sure it's really nice and tight. And you're gonna wear a mask too. And since we won't be able to see each other real good, we won't be able to see if someone's smiling to know if we're doing a good job at what we're doing in our, our project, if someone likes it. So we're gonna start giving each other a thumbs up. Like if you see someone who's doing a really nice project and you like their project, give them a thumbs up and say, good work, good work, okay? And you keep working. So that's how we're gonna do it. But we're gonna make sure that we follow these rules. We're gonna stay in our seats. We're not gonna get up and run around the room. We're not gonna get up at all. We're gonna stay in our seats, stay six feet apart. We're not gonna share materials. We're gonna keep our own supplies in our own area with our names on our bags. We're gonna wear our mask. We're not gonna take our mask off to tell people things. We're gonna give each other a thumbs up sign when we like what we see happening. We're gonna make sure that we wash our hands in warm, soapy water for 20 minutes. We're gonna follow all these rules. And even when we're in the hallway, we're gonna keep sure our mask is really nice and tight around our ears. And mine's attached to my headband so that if I'm alone in my classroom, 
like this room that stores my art stuff, even though I have a cart and I'm going to be coming into your classroom, if I'm alone in my room, I can take off my mask, but only when you're alone in a room, okay? Because the droplets from your breath can stay in the room for a while and you don't want anyone to breathe them in. Maybe take them home and give them to an older person who might get sick from them. But we need to follow these rules because they're very, very important. But most of all, we want to remember one important thing about art that's not going to change. And that is, in art, we're going to have fun. We're going to have a, a lot of fun this year. I'm just going to take this off since I'm alone in the room. We're going to have fun doing art because in art, we're going to work on decision making, problem solving, using our creativity. We're going to use, um, what else? Decision making, I said our imaginations, because we're going to develop them really good. And most of all, we're going to remember that there's no right or wrong in art. Whatever you decide to do is going to be just perfect, because we're all different. So what you decide is one thing, isn't what I'm going to decide. I might choose yellow. You might choose blue. You might say purple, and I might say a circle. You might say square. And whatever you decide is going to be fine, okay? Because in art, there's no right or wrong. So we wanna remember that this year, whatever you decide in art is gonna be fine as long as you remember there's no right and wrong as long as you try. So let's have a great year, let's keep safe, let's follow these rules that we need to follow in the art room and we're gonna have a fantastic year. Bye everybody, I can't wait to see you in art class and in the Zooms. So we're gonna have a great safe year. God bless, bye.